Click this. Watch. It's gonna erupt. So awesome. Okay, right now he's loading his old version and oh my gosh, look at this. Wait, what? This is so awesome, man. Look at this. Wow. But what if I go inside? I wonder. Bing, bang, bing. <laughs> That's cool. It launches me and then it brings me back. Wait, what? Honestly, this version looks really, really awesome. Like, cooler than mine because it's more detailed. But... Oh, oh. <laughs> Those are some huge magma blocks. It would be awesome if they killed you. Okay, okay. I'm ready to see it happen. Oh, oh, oh. It's happening. It's happening. All right, first, make sure the blocks are anchored. Very important. And set merge level to red. Now select any material that you want to make your volcano out of. I recommend the slate block. This one. By the way, huge thanks to my friend Faza for making this awesome volcano mechanic. But obviously you can use any material. Actually, we're also going to set the rotate number over here to 45. And watch. Alright, now before we place it, we're going to tilt it once up. If you're in computer, press T. If you're on mobile, well, uh, there's a button to tilt it. Now select through the scale tool. And actually, we're going to set the scale number over here to 2. It's going to help us a lot throughout this video, so make sure you set it to 2. Alright, now we're going to make it about uh, 8 blocks big, I think. So... So over here, the number should be 16. And let's make it about nine blocks. Is this tall? I guess, yeah. Let's call it nine blocks tall. So uh, actually, over here. So the number over here should be 18. And here, let's tuck this in a little bit here and move this like that. Okay, so he's building a different type of volcano. You can build a volcano any way you want, but trust me, it's the easiest way and it actually looks the best. All right, now make sure to like and subscribe for more awesome, original, buildable tutorials and content like this. You won't regret it, trust me. Now we're gonna rotate it and tilt upwards and it should be like this similarly we're gonna make it 16 here so eight blocks wide nine blocks tall and correct like this and now just continue this throughout like this you see i'm correcting some things here so that the gaps here are as small as they could be Okay, uh, as you can see, it's not completely perfect. So just do your best to fix some things and make the top small, like this. There we go, Nano Volcano is actually looking really nice. Okay, let me just paint some things here. All right, now we're gonna do this. We're gonna place a block about here. And we're gonna make it kind of like a square on top. Here, you'll see what I mean. This, and now this. And like this uh wait one second let me fix this there we go you see about a square on top here let's fix this a little bit there we go looks a lot better so now you want to extend all of these parts of the square down like this make sure they are attached to the ground and do it to each of them as said okay now inside of this box uh, it's actually kind of small but it's kind of okay if it is okay actually let me try to make these walls thinner all right now select the magnet rotate this up and place quite a few like this doesn't have to be even just place a bunch you yeah, actually I'm gonna rotate some of them there we go this should be good but we're not done yet so here I'm gonna select the wings you can select the jetpack eater now we're gonna make the square a lot taller you can make these parts of the square as tall as you want Keep in mind that this is the distance the lava is gonna erupt from so if you make it this tall lava is gonna erupt very 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 high so bad this height is good all right, now we're not done yet, but select the delay block, place two of them like this, then place the switch, and next to it, place another switch. Remove the switch and spine it to everything. Hi, do you like my channel? Please say yes. Well, if you do, please do start with Legion by Grubbox or Premium to support me. It's totally free, but really helps me out. Thanks, guys. And this one should be bind to one of the hourglasses. Now bind the delay blocks to each other, so this one to this one, and this one to this one. Now bind all the magnets to both delay blocks. Yes, both. Watch. So just go in here and select all of these. If you're in computer, you can hold shift while selecting all of them. And then do this. With all of them selected. Click one delay blocks. And now do the same for the other one. And this one. There we go. Now select all and set delay time to 0 0.5. There we go. All right, now select the name block. Place it about here and scale it like this, I guess. And make it like this. Okay, actually, I'm gonna make the walls transparent temporarily. Here, see what I mean? It's gonna be like the top of the volcano. Okay, let's actually move this down a little bit. And let's paint this, uh, oh, if we can even. 
zoom in and paint the lava this color. That looks nice. Very important, make this uncollidable. If you don't, it's gonna really screw things up. Now make the walls back to being visible. And make another platform here, but this time don't make it out of neon, it's gonna be hard to see. Make it out of plastic or really any block. Now, make your magma or lava or whatever you want to erupt out of the volcano on top of this platform and make a bunch of it, like this. What if I make a bunch of tiny micro blocks? Ooh. Okay, actually, if I do a bunch of micro blocks, uh, it's really gonna lag the server, so I'm just gonna do a bunch of regular blocks as well. Okay, now I'm just gonna paint randomly here and just constantly clone it. By the way, make sure you're not cloning it above the height of this. Because if you do, then some blocks are gonna go out of the volcano even before you erupt. So make sure it's within this height. All right, now when ready, remove this plastic block. And so all of the erupting blocks that you placed should be right above of this hole over here. Make the walls transparent. And also try to make the magnets transparent if you can. And uncollidable. Let me make this transparent too. And I'm gonna move this over here. Make sure you don't replace it because it's gonna bind to random things. Place the sign, say erupt if you want, and make that invisible so it's only the text. And when ready, save. And every time you load it in, on the girl. And obviously, press the switch. Watch. Uh, <laughs> um, I think I added too many blocks. It's very, very laggy. Maybe it was a mistake adding those micro blocks. Oh no. Bro, the server literally crashed because we both found server cameras at the exact same time. Alright, so let's retry that. Wait, what? Mine didn't save. This is a previous Falcon version. What? Okay, at least I have this saved. Bro, Buildable is glitching a lot right now. He says you may not save or load your boat right now. Try again later. I think something's going on with the game. Alright, using this different Falcon version. I'll ignore a few blocks of lava that I fell out. I click this. Watch. It's gonna erupt. So awesome. Okay, right now he's loading his old version and oh my gosh. Look at this. Wait, what? So it starts out with a few and then even more comes out. Very cool. But what if I go inside? I wonder. Bing, bang, bing. <laughs> That's cool. It launches me and then it brings me back. Wait, what? This is so awesome, man. Look at this. Wow. Oh, oh, those are some huge magma blocks. It would be awesome if they killed you. Okay, okay, I'm ready to see it happen. Oh, 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 it's happening, it's happening. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more awesome build videos like this. And watch another really awesome video of mine on screen. See you next video. Bye, guys.